Hmm, what beer do I want to try next? Beer time, it's beer time with the beer man. The word of the day is orange. Hey, how's it going, everyone? How are you doing tonight, today, wherever you're from in this beautiful world? I tell you, I'm doing all right tonight. I'm doing good, doing good. Um, my prayers are with the people in California. I hope you're all right right now. Called my mom down there. She's doing fine, so we're good. All right, so I have the Rogue 8 Hop IPA, and it is using collaboration of eight different hops. I'm from the Rogue Farms in Independence, Oregon. Um, wow. It's 8.88% ABV and 80 IBUs. So everything's evolving around this eight number. Infinite, infinity. It's wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. I'm really looking forward to this. I really like their, what was it, the six hop IPA? Or, yeah, yeah, six hop IPA. Really, really good. Mm. Let's open it up. 8.88. And it's a big one. I just want to twirl a little bit, see if there's anything in the bottom. Get some flavors coming out of the yeast. If there's any yeast. <laughs> it looks pretty clear to me. <laughs> yeah, no, well, it's, it's actually got kind of a, well, we'll go into that. Hold on. This is starting at about a two-finger head. Let's go ahead and smell. Oh, yes, real malty, floral. Got a somewhat of a candy kind of smell to it, like Pez candies or something. Definitely a malty, fruity Pez candy-like floralness coming out of the smell. Pretty malty though, very sweet malt. Caramel malts, definitely. There's some real sweet caramel malts coming out of this. And then that hop expression, just bursting through it all. The balance and everything was real nice. It's real nice smelling in this beer, so. Let's go ahead and look at this beer. Yes, this beer. So, we went from about a two finger head to about a finger head. It's an off-white, almost an orange tinge to the head in a way. It's kind of weird. More of an off-white, let's say. A rocky, pebbly foam. Somewhat firm, lacing on the glass is real lovely and nice. Seems to be, let's say. Yeah, sticking quite well. My glass is clean. It's got a bit of a haze to it. Somewhat dull. A slow to medium rising bubble. Looks thick and viscous somewhat. Just looks rich. And it's got an orange copper like color. You can only see shadows. You can't see anything else really. Um, yeah, you only see a shadow. It's definitely got some alcohol. You can taste that. You can you can taste like feel the alcohol go up to your palate, through your nose. Somewhat alcoholic, but beyond that, uh, definitely I would not pound this. I would sip it for a while. <clears throat> it's delicious, guys, but it's very 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 thick and rich. 
on the palate, on the tongue, around the mouth. It, it, um, it, it surrounds everything with this thick layering of sweet malt and hops. A little tingly on the tongue at first, but then it smooths out. And this is real sweet and rich. There's a little bit of melon in there. There might be a little pine. The alcohol rises, palate uh, gets this burst of malt and hops. This balance is perfect, very perfect balance. It's very, it's got a floral kind of flavor as well to it. The finish is almost a long uh, finish. You're kind of feeling it all around. And it probably is because it's also coating your mouth in, in, in the whole making of it all. You know, it's like, wow, this is like not going away. <laughs> it's just sitting there. It's uh, somewhat resinous, oily, uh, very hoppy. Has a bitter around the cheeks inside. Man, this is a real nice beer, guys. It's got a lot of surprises. It's a real fun beer to drink. It's crisp, it's easy drinking as well, but it's also very strong and, and poisonous. I mean, I'm, I'm, doing, when I, I'm just saying, like, kind of like, you know, be careful with this one. <laughs> Small sips. But uh, no, it's good. It's really good. There's some orange flavors coming out of that as well. Orange with the melon and the bitter rides off in the back. It does have a bitter dryness around the back as well. But that sweet still kind of stays there. Right on, so out of uh, five hops, I'll give this 4.5 hops. Now that's not a bad beer at all. Right on, so please comment. Let me know what you think. If you've had it before, let's compare notes. And uh, please subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that bell so you'll be notified when I have new shows up. If you're new, check out my intro and uh, subscribe. It'd be great. Hit the bell. And hit the like button. That'd be awesome. Right on, guys. Gals. Awesome. Love y'all very much. Cheers. Peace. I'm out. Just one more sip.